Home is where the heart is. I met her in 1941 and at, at the roller skating rink because I was went there with my chum and he said you could roller skate. I said I don't know how to roller skate. What's the matter with you? <laughs> Anyways, and that's and I thought she was really the prettiest girl you know there was that I seen for a long while. So then I asked her, do you want to roller skate? And I said, I don't, can't roller skate too well. Oh, that's all right. She said, I'll go with you. So <laughs> that's how we, we went. And then we went back, you know, every week we used to go back for quite a while. Got engaged when I was 19. And when I left to go overseas, she said, listen, we should get married. And I said, no, just in case I don't return. I said, so the ring, you can keep it as a souvenir. You know, you never know when you go to war that whether you come back alive or not. You never. In those times, you didn't know. So. Can't do much then. And we were married July the thirteenth, forty-six. We were married. Uh, 61 years when she passed away. I always had it in my mind, you know, that she would come back, but no, no, because her sickness was too much. Uh, her illness all started out that she lost short term memory loss, and it's it's a thing that she, they wouldn't you t could tell her something now, five minutes later she wouldn't remember, and it just got worse and worse and there's so many dimensions to it. One thing is your loss of memory, the other thing you don't know how to put your clothes on or tie your shoes. That's all dimensions. They don't like to call it Alzheimer's and that's why I said it's dimensions. But you know she was she was good but then when she broke her hip and that sort of put the finishing touches on it. So. I uh, put her in, in the nursing home in July the 13th 1999 and I used to go every day to see her except you know if I was on vacation for a week or something I have I would be but I most of the time I was there and and it was hard you uh, you come home there's nobody here so that's the tough part of it I never I never slept that night, I never slept at all. I was up all night drinking coffee, and the next day I was right back there again. But I eventually got so I could could sleep and stuff, and always worried about her. I used to have a phone by the bed because just in case they called. I got through it by I went to meetings. Alzheimer's had meetings, and then they used to talk about, and other people used to talk about their their loved ones and uh, what they were doing and that and that's how we sort of survived. And, yeah, she was creative. They did everything that she she and in the house here was always part of her. She if she wanted a bird put there, I got the I said just a minute I get the glue out and a little drill and drill the hole and put the put the thing in there and glue it. I said, How's that? And then she goes, no no don't touch it. It's not dry yet. <laughs> <laughs> I used to put the little dots on, and she said that's a fish or something else. I don't know. It was it was fun to do things with her. You know. uh, oh God, I'm telling you, the things that I used to do, and, and she wanted something made, and I said, well, what do you want to make? Like what? And I used to make all that stuff. For her, so. We used to kid back and forth all the time, and you know, and, uh, and she said, you're terrible. I said, no, I'm not. And I said. <laughs> But I, you, we used to kibbage back and forth. I mean, that's you got. If you get into a, a little quarrel over something, just sit back and, and think about it, and, and then just say, "Well, I'm sorry. I guess you're right." Like, you know, you you talk it out, and if, if everything worked okay, bingo, it's done. You 
got to have patience and don't let don't let somebody get to you that's all otherwise you're going to be in the cemetery down on uh, Victoria Long <laughs> I tell you it was it was fun doing that you got to you got to make fun out of it always have a sense of humor i don't care what you do she was really great she she done everything she used to you know do things that I never thought that she could do, but it was really great. She was, she was a great person, honestly.